Gamers on Games is sponsored in part by... This episode was brought to you by The Mythwits, a geek pop culture talk show. Every week we interview an industry guest and make with the funny. Check us out at Mythwits.com, YouTube, and iTunes, and watch us live every Monday night at 9.30 p.m. EST. And by viewers like you. This is going to be... This is a... This is another episode of Gamers on Games. Today we'll be looking at a bunch of products from uh, Armorcast, um, part of their Mabakushi C body count line, product line, which is a new game that they're in development on, and we'll be looking for a play tester shortly. Um, the first two are two of their bo box sets of t t tactical teams, one being the SWAT team and the other one being the NARC squad. And we also have the limited edition CD bar there will only be 100 to 120 of these produced, depending on how long the, the molds last. These were first available at Gen Con this year. There are a few left over from, from stock on that, and they will be cast to order until the molds, 100 or 120 uses of the mold. In which case, it'll, this design will not be available anymore. First off, we're going to take a look at Mobocracy's Body Count's uh, SWAT Team TAC001 on the ArmorCast website. Retails for $25. It includes five figures um, and 28 millimeter scale and five resin bases from, uh, for their cityscape. We also have <clears throat> playtesting counters and blast ring which and body uh, body markers dead body markers so let's take a look at what we've got in here this is the SWAT team um, let's get the box out of the way all right first off we'll take a look at these bases they're really nice detail nice city street stuff sewer cover great detail markers or not markers um like traffic covers and that kind of stuff sidewalk and street this is another sidewalk with actual curb on it which is one of my favorite bases because of the flat edge on it it's just a little bit different and then we've got the different poses the SWAT members just love the details in these guys each pose is different this one's armed with a shotgun as opposed to the MP5 that the last one had. Another MP5. Another MP5. Nice squatting, crouching pose. This one also looks like it's an MP5. Looks a little bit different. This is a nice, uh, standing by the door type of pose so that is the contents of the uh the SWAT team pack nice nice little pack i mean this would be good for making a diorama of a, br a room clearing also that <clears throat> i'm looking forward to using these guys in the maboxy body count rules um, we haven't played test with the SWAT team yet or the, the NARC unit, which we'll be looking at next. We've been mainly doing the high-tech criminals and the, uh, the, the rookie cops, so I'm looking forward to getting these guys onto the table soon to play, play test. All right, next we're going to look at the uh, Mabakushi Body Count NARC Squad, TAC003 on the ArmorCast website. Again, this is five figures, five base of the, the scenic bases, cityscape bases. Also, another play test markers. Um, and then we'll go into here. We've already looked at the bases. There are actually six total 
designs, and I got the same five again. Yeah, same five. I think there's six designs. Thought that's what comes in the uh, standard set. I'll have to look that up. But, alright. Five figures. One two-piecer. The rest, si single pieces. First off, the sniper. There's a great pose. Great detail. Let's try and get this to focus. There we go. M4 on his back. Sniper rifle, boonie hat. Nice detailing. Another one. The other thing that I've been wanting to try doing with these narcs is, yeah, there there is a faction for the narc squad in the mobocracy body count rules. These also have not been play tested. And I want to get these guys on the field, but I'm also thinking that these also might make a good double for feds instead of just the narc squad. Because to me, these look like federal operatives, so. Or um, DEA, which I guess would be like a narc squad. We d I just watched Sabotage a few weeks ago, so I've kind of got the whole DEA special operations team things in my mind. So we got this one. It, no arms on him, and I'll show you why in a second. He's got the outstretched pistol arms. See if I can dry fit them. Nope. Do I have? Oh wait. Here we go. I think I can get the flash off so I can show you what it looks like. There we go. Flash off. And those will fit right in. Need a little bit of tweaking, a little bit of filing, but boom. There he is. So. That is the Narc Squad, which I'm going to probably end up using as feds. So, all right. And that, next we'll be looking at the uh, CD bar. And finally, we're going to take a look at the CD bar. Um, inside... We have our accessory pack, which we'll take a look at after we look at the building. We've got the front, which also has the interior detail. The different walls with interior detail as well. Back door. Tiled floor. Sidewalk, which is I, I love the sidewalk in this. Look at the cracks and everything. This will be fun to paint. Also included is the bar countertop itself. This way, haha. <laughs> there you go. Bar countertop. Now, this is a new piece to Armorcast site. It has not been added to the online catalog yet, so it's currently only available through this. It is their sky their skylight roof topper I I love this piece also one of the other roof toppers included in this set is the uh, the roof access door these these pieces make great handles when you for when you put the building together you put these on that way you have something to pull the roof off so you can get to your interior detail and also included is the pile of trash to go with the back door so let's move this box out of the way and we'll take a look at the uh, detail pack. Inside here we have one lamp post. So it's got a little bit of flash on it. Nothing big. Clean that once that gets cleaned up. This will be nice. You can hang signs or banners or whatever decorations you want for your cityscape. One road sign. So you put street names and stuff. Great, great details for a cityscape. One parking meter, which I've used in another project. I had a uh, a robot that was you you holding that as a uh, a club. This is your 
criminal, high tech criminal. Nicely escaped. I, this is the leader piece out of the uh, Mobocracy Body Counts uh, high tech criminals starter set. Here's a, another another uh, SWAT team member, and we also have one hostage. This set comes with standard 25 millimeter round bases, not the cityscape bases.